I'm just gonna do it. I've only got two logs left to run through the Yappa. Amanda's busy, so I'm just gonna do it. There's five logs left, right? There's six, six logs left. But four of them are a little bit uh, bigger diameter. These two, however, they are small enough, so they are gonna get run through right now. Second log done, under a minute. So I stacked up most of the, most of this pile here. This stuff is actually just needs to be re-split. So this pile is re-split that I'll take over to the Wolf Ridge. But you can see this last piece here, this last log that we ran through. These pieces are about at the, uh, the about the max diameter that I like running through with the four-way. Decent size splits, uh, actually pretty much just right. Some of them a little smaller. So that stuff now I'm gonna stack, start a new row right there. And like I said, this little pile and that little pile are all bigger pieces that need to be re-split. All right, so I uh, just ripped my pants some more. All right, so I got the Yappa moved out of the way, but I got a lot going on that I want to get done because this weekend is supposed to be raining all weekend. So I want to get everything kind of picked up and then moved over by the splitter and staged so that this weekend, if it is raining, I can be under the shelter and still be getting something done. So we got the Yappa moved out of the way. I'm going to pick up these logs. Well, first I'm going to pick up, I got the splits that I need to resplit. I got to take those to the splitter and then I got Big pieces that are already split in front of the splitter I need to get rid of. And then I gotta get these logs over and get those bucked up. So yeah, plenty to do.
So I've got all the pieces that I need to resplit over here. I got those four remaining logs that were left over that were a little too big for the Yappa. Got those bucked up. So the forecast is calling for rain this weekend, Friday, Saturday, and I don't know about Sunday. But so what I was thinking is I would take this tarp that I had and maybe fasten it up here on the shelter and just kind of drape it down and that way I'll have all these rounds covered and I'll be able to still like kind of work under that tarp this weekend um, if it is raining. But I think my tarp might be a little too big. So I gotta spread this thing out and just see. Um, I don't remember what size this thing is. It's big, <laughs> but it's the best one I have. So I figured why not use it? Let's see how this works. Hook that up there. And then if I come over here, Oh yeah, that might just work. <laughs> yeah, this, <laughs> this tarp is plenty big. Still got a little bit of daylight left, so I think that's gonna do it for today. I got a lot done, a lot of little odds and ends stuff, you know, just like moving the yappa, moving those logs, moving the splits that were here, picking up these for resplit. I mean, all those little things, they all take time and they add up, but actually I got quite a bit of done and uh, I still got a little bit of time to enjoy the rest of this second day of November. 74 degree temperatures pretty nice so uh tomorrow night on the back for a live stream i'm gonna have some more details on the giveaway the pick your prize giveaway um if you haven't checked that out there's a link in the description i'm also going to reveal what i actually ended up what i ended up getting and what's going to be uh i guess uh, the big reveal of what i'm bringing and adding to the live stream some people made some guesses um, it's not, nothing really too major, but you'll see, it's going to be cool. It's going to really add something, going to give me a chance to do, uh, I'll just tell you tomorrow night on the back for your live stream. I'll show you. Uh, hopefully we'll see you there. 8 PM central right here on the back 40 firewood channel Friday night live. Oh, it's always fun. So thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Stay safe, have fun and be cool.